I have developed a kernel switch for the Commodore C64 which is controlled by the keyboard. Holding the restore key and the number switches to another kernel corresponding to that number and resets the C64. Just holding the restore key for several seconds will reset the C64 only. The kernel switch consists of a microcontroller board, a kernel adapter, the cables in between and a simple pin to connect the reset of the C64. So let's start with the Commodore kernel and press Restore 2. Now we have Jeffy Das. Restore 3 will give us Jeffy Das. Restore 4 is Exos V3. Restore 5 Speed Das. Restore 6 Dolphin DOS Restore 7 Toro Tape Restore 1 will switch back to the original kernel Holding the restore key for some seconds It's resetting the C64 Now we will switch to Exos V3 The index of the selected kernel is stored in a non-volatile memory. After switching off the C64 and switching it on again... Okay, that will take some time. We have Exos V3 again, so it's not lost. The kernel switch is installed on the keyboard connector. And the kernel adapter holds the kernel EEPROM. Here's the reset cables close to the user port. Dupont cables are available on eBay and elsewhere. They can be used for wiring. There are two types of kernel adapters for short boards with 7 kernels and a basic and long boards with 8 kernels. The software is based on an Arduino sketch for easy modification. A serial cable service for debugging and uploading a sketch. The initial programming is done via the ICSP connector.